Mike Weaver operates the um, Mike Weaver Farm in Fort no. Siebert, West Virginia. I'm essentially really happy with the unit I have when it is working. Uh, one of the reasons I agreed to participate in the evaluation of this system is because it's affordable for farmers, or it would be if it was marketed the way it was designed and set up on my farm. When I say affordable, it's um, Wayne Combustion intended this unit to be um, assembled at their plant, delivered to your farm, uh, set in place, connected, and a building constructed around it for somewhere in the $150,000 range. Uh, payback would depend, of course, on your uh, propane usage or whatever heat source you currently have. Uh, for me, it would be in the four to five year range. And for most of the growers here in our area, that would be similar, depending on how big their operation is. Um, one, one of the real benefits of the unit I have was the dry heat that it produced. Uh, I have brooder stoves. Uh, 36 brooder stoves in each one of my houses now providing heat, propane. And if you're familiar with propane, you know that it produces almost a gallon of water for each gallon of propane that burns, which adds a tremendous amount of moisture into the houses and it has to be ventilated out, which creates a need for more heat and, and more ventilation and so on and so on. Uh, with this dry heat produced by this furnace, we didn't have that problem. Uh, Ventilation <clears throat> could be uh, adjusted according to the temperature of the house without much of any loss of uh, propane generated heat. Uh, and it, thereby it kept the floors drier in the house, which created a better environment uh, overall for the birds. And, and my production, uh, although I, d I didn't get to use it as much as I'd like to because of uh, problems with the system and, and reliability in the system. When it was running well, it did very well. It produced good heat. I think my production was improved by the use of this furnace. Um, one of the, a couple of the things that um, are downsides, I guess you would have to say about this system is that uh, it was designed too complex, in my opinion. They put too many sensors on it, and every time one of the sensors would trip, it would shut down the furnace, uh, which meant I had to be I had to be checking the furnace constantly to make sure it was running. And if it did shut it down, if it was a, a internal combustion firebox essentially re related issue, we had to wait for the furnace to cool down uh, before we could get in to, to find out what was wrong and correct it. And get first fired back up again. So it was too labor intensive, too time consuming for me. Um, I think it has the potential to be an excellent system. It has a little more development put into it. And I'm hoping that somebody uh, takes that up. The, the company, Wayne Combustion, who started this side company essentially to, to create this system and market it has pretty much decided to dispose of that um, company and they're looking for a buyer now. So we're kind of in limbo hoping that somebody picks it up and continues with the development of this system.